I used to hate running, literally. But these days, I've been enjoying it a lot. By these days, I mean the last two mornings, but honestly, I've been getting this craving for waking up early, like 6.30, and going for a run. I just, I leave the house for like 20 minutes. I go to the park right next to our house and just run as much as I can. I think the most I can do is like three minutes 30, three minutes and a half. Then I stop, I walk a bit, and I start again. And I, then I come back home after like 20 minutes of being gone. Hello, I'm Maya. So today, I'm out of breath because I've been, I'm jogging in the park right next to my house. And as you can see, I didn't put, put any makeup, not an ounce. Um, it doesn't look as bad on the camera, but you can definitely see I've had some acne problems. Uh, this year, I got an IUD installed and definitely messed up with my hormones. Um, I got a lot of acne on my back too. I got a lot of water retention. My breasts shrunk, shrank. <laughs> So the, the worst part about it was my acne. Uh, I was traveling, as you can maybe know. I was traveling in Latin America the whole year. And um, it definitely affected me. I couldn't really look people in the, in the eyes. And I was like trying my hardest to just smile so that at least one thing would be nice about looking at my face. And I know it's bad to think that way, but when you when you're in the situation you just can't help it and of course i had some days when i was like embrace your acne i'm grateful for my pimples because they're teaching me something you know but some days i would just look at myself and cry and cry and, cry. and it's not even just the appearance it was painful like when you smile your skin stretches and especially here um and actually it's been getting better i've been back for um, more than a week and I've been really taking care of my skin um, in many ways, masks and with my with food. So yeah. I actually always see people running like in the city, like in Ottawa near the Parliament. I could never do that. I really need to be like amongst the trees. But I'm so happy to be here and breathe, breathe like the, the fresh air. And I literally, I think I crossed one woman's path. That's all. I'm alone, like I'm alone, alone. Okay, so this is becoming a long introduction. I just wanted to kind of tell you about what I, what I want to do with this channel. And I really want to take you with me in my journey to, um, you know, healing my skin, healing my body from everything I put it through with the IUD. It's just terrible, terrible, terrible. I really don't recommend getting an IUD. Um, I want to do some recipe videos. I want to talk about um, how hormones are so important and how they affect every little thing in your body. I want to answer your questions. I want to talk about anything related to a holistic lifestyle. I want to talk about beauty, I want to talk about travel, uh, so many things. And I hope I can inspire you along the way. Alright, time for breakfast. So this is not all I'm having. Those are four atalfo mangoes and I'm missing the Cuban and Mexican mangoes, I have to say. I have some strawberries. This is the fourth mango which I didn't cut yet because um, the three mangoes already filled the, the plate and I just wanted to you know, take a, a nice picture. So, just to show you, I do have a fourth mango on the way. And I do eat these parts. I do. I love them. <laughs> 